Give me a break. What are you accusing Yevon of this time? Yevon did something really bad to us before. Well, you Albed must have deserved it. I beg your pardon? Waka! Uh, can't you guys talk about this later? Just promise you won't tell anyone about this island. Promise? Waka. Waka, come on! All right, I promise. Lead the way. You got it. from Rage Break Gaming, and where the fuck do we go now? Well, let's play Final Fantasy X HD Remaster. Well, by where do we go now, I mean, how the fuck do we get out of here? Apparently, we're trapped under Lake Makalani, and we decided on going to Bavel in order to seek forgiveness from Maester Micah, or to really to explain what the fuck happened with Seymour. Ooh, we'll see if that goes well. That being said, though, um, off screen, I did create some new um, armors for um, Titus, Waka, and Riku. Now, I created the alert shield for Titus. Now, this was initially a glorious shield for him. They had HP plus 5%, but I put Dark Proof and Sleep Ward. Um, blind and Sleep Status we're going to be dealing with soon. So, having Dark Proof and or Sleep Ward and Dark Proof would be very useful. Got the bright charge for Riku. I only had one slot for her, so I put Dark Proof on her. For Waka, I forced the Alerts Arm Guard for um, Dark Proof and Sleep Ward. Otherwise, the Nat though, um, next area that we're going to be going to has five um, enemies weak to fire, lightning, and um, and ice. Some weak to um, water, but not a lot. So having elemental weapons will still be useful. That being said, though, is that coming from the temple? Yes, it is Yevon's gift. It soothes the hearts of the faithful. Hmm. Who the fuck is really singing it, though? And if you hear some noise in the background, that's my, um, fan going on. It is, like, over 90 degrees where I am. So, needless to say, try to deal with it, my, my dear viewers. Say, you feel something weird in the air. Some kind of bad vibes or something. Hmm. Probably all your racism. But, it, now that I think about it, it does feel kind of weird in here, though. The music alone. I thought so. Hmm. I really feel weird. <laughs> Are you sure it's not the after effects of the racism? Because I, I, I don't know, Waka. Who is that singing? The face. Nani? Oh. Huh? The Faith? What? It can sing? Of course it can. Don't be a fool. <laughs> well, how the fuck would I would have known that, Big Tits? Say, isn't the ground shaking? Shaking? I don't feel no shaking. Unless you're talking about shaking bacon. But no, no okay, that was a fail. <laughs> Friends, huh? First time a non bed called me that. Wow. I guess it goes to show that Albed really aren't liked in this world. That is such a shame. I'm sure that Maester Micah will listen to us. Mm, I hope so, because if not, we bone. I'm sure that... Like, if he doesn't listen to us and he doesn't help us out, we might be put in, in a jail cell for killing Seymour. This place smells different now. Can Mari not know if this good or bad? Can mm. Mari feel no danger? It smells different, but you feel no danger? Hmm. Well, in any case, over here, we get an Avenger for Titus. Didn't we already have an Avenger for him? Yeah, this one had um, counterattack on it. This is a. It's the same fucking thing! Wow. I guess it's I guess this is for if you didn't get the um Now I think about it, I think we got this from I, I purchased this from a Waka back in during Operation Meehan. So yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess if you didn't purchase it from him, this would be your first one. 
Jack used to sing this song. <laughs> yeah, over and over. <laughs> <laughs> but not this good, that's for sure. Probably off key. Another trait you share. Huh? Uh, what? You were listening? Huh. Bruh, I know you were watching over me, but can I... Sing it, please. Hey, can I get a little privacy? <laughs> Your singing reminded me of Spira. Ah. Uh. All right. You're not originally from Xanarkin, are you? You homesick? Maybe. Maybe. Where are you from anyway, Orn? Say, how'd you get to Xanarkind anyway? Sin? Hmm. Tidus' eyes look so gorgeous. They did a uh -huh. good job. I thought so. That proved it. Sin was the link between Xanarkind and Spira. Which means, if we kill Sin, I'll never be able to go home. Are you still on that? At this point, you might as well stay with the squad and finish Sin off. I mean, come on. I mean, I know you'll miss your um your Blitzball homies and shit like that back in Xanax, even though it was technically already destroyed by the time you left. But why would you want to go back to a city that was just destroyed? Hello? I mean, you, you got Yuna here, which is a potential love interest for you. Probably future girlfriend, probably. Um, you got Big Tits here. You got Racist Waka. You got Perky Riku. You got, um, um, Stoic Kamari. You know what? Yeah, I kind of would miss Blissfall. But I miss my homies, too. We should get moving soon. How do we get out of here, though? Hmm? Huh? The singing stopped. Shit. Whoa! NANI?! There's something here! The ground. The ground? Oh my god! Oh no! It, it's Sin! Where is he though? Is he under us? Oh shit! Oh shit! Sin! Fuck! The toxin, watch out! Damn! Ooh. Well, it was then I knew that Sin really was my old man. For the first time, I was finally able to believe it. The song you were listening to. What is it this time? Whoa. I assume we're not dead. <laughs> what the? Huh? Xanarkind. Is this another flashback? Ah. You homesick too? Wait. Are these Chet's memories? Huh. That's... Not your world anymore. You're Sin now. Yeah, you're a giant monster slash alien. You can't play Blitzball no more. There's young Titus. So, okay, so we are looking through the lens of Jet. Hey, I'm older now, you know? Are you really? You kind of you kind of still act like you're, you're, you know what, never mind. I know. You want this to end. I'll end it for you, Dad. I'll find a way. Promise. If Dad doesn't confirm that sin is jet for you in your mind, Titus, then I don't know what the fuck will. I think, I think at this point he all... What the... Where the fuck are we? What? We were just in an ice. We were under lake ice. Now we're in a desert? Huh. Where am I? 
What the hell? I forgive you this time. Be good for a while, okay? Huh. Where are we? Oasis. Yeah, yeah, that's very creative game. That being said though, um, viewers, I will remind you again to forge equipment that prevents blind and sleep because we're going to be dealing with that in this area. So, how do we get from an icy area to a desert? I guess, I guess Sin teleported us here. Or whatever the fuck he did. But if that's the case, where are the others? I guess we gotta find them. Ah! What the hell? Hey yo, what the fuck? Whoa! Phew. That is a big ass bird! But in any case, this guy should look familiar if you play Final Fantasy 4 and 5. Yes! Zoo! There is no Dana, only Zoo. This one, uh, there are two varieties of them. This one and this battle with Titus, um, 12,000 HP. He has no weaknesses. You can steal um, some smoke bombs from the guy. And you can steal a lot of them from the Zoo. So, there you go. But yeah, let's get this bitch out. No! Huh. That wasn't enough? I... How about this then? Holy might! Shine so bright! Ha! On your knees, bitch! <laughs> oh! Is that all you got? Hmm. You're so pathetic. Mental break! Fuck you! Fuck yeah! <laughs> Are you alright? Lulu! We rock! Hmm. Let's go. Y'all showed up kinda late. I didn't even need y'all help. <laughs> but thank you. I was I was gonna be looking for you anyway, so you saved me some time. Uh I'll bet potions. What? Hmm, hi. <sighs> Sup dudes? The others? <sighs> Haven't found them yet. We're supposed to stay in one place if we get split up. Wait here if you want. He's not. Of course Orin is gonna go. I ain't staying here with all this sand. Like, there's sand in my eyes. Crotch and ass. Like, seriously, how can anyone live in this place? Does... Does anyone live here? Waka! Waka! Waka waka! Mm. What's up, bro? You alone? Mm hmm. Where's Yuna? Uh. Um. Uh, um. Damn it! First I lose Yuna, then I'm ambushed by Machina. Great day I'm having. <laughs> Damn. Well, shit. Poor Waka. Who are you? But in the case, I'll bet first aid kit. A first aid kit placed by the outbed to eight desert travelers. Oh! Wait. I'll bet trap. Huh. Are the outbed from this place? If we're getting outbed potions. Huh. Weird. But yeah, in any case, we got Waka back. Hooray! Alright, um. I, I guess we gotta find um, Yuna, Riku, and Kamari then. Alright. Ah, I see Kamari over there. Well, at least he's safe. Hey, Lion Bro! What are you doing? It's not going to work. Trust me, I tried that in the past. It won't work. Yuna gone. It's not your fault, Kamari. It's all good, bro. We got your bag. We'll find her. Alright, we got Kamari back. We just need to find Riku and Yuna. Alrighty then. Perfect. Huh? Whoa! <laughs> wow! Gotcha, bitch! The battle just started, and Waka literally got ambushed by two of these Machinas. Wow, man. 
goes to show that you reap what you sow. Eh, Waka? Eh? But in any case, new enemy here, mock guards. These are similar to those worker, um, um, mocking the droids that we fought back in Luka way earlier in the game. These ones have 1,280 HP to weak the lightning. Ah! They're also weak to steel attacks. Well, not steel. Not iron tail. I'm talking about, like, using steel on them. Break them down. Told ya. Told ya, bitches. But, yeah. If you use steel and or mug on the on those Machina guards, they will break down. Basically, you know, oofed. So, you know, there you go. Wow! Here we go. That is a big ass worm! And that is the sandworm. <laughs> 45,000 HP with the ice and water. He has the highest amount of HP of anyone in this of any monster in this desert. That is a lot. A lot. However, the nice thing about this guy is that you can steal shadow gems from him. Shadow gems are used to cast um demi in battle. So, you know, just keep that in mind. The best way to deal with the sandworms is to use bio on them. You can learn bio via Lulu's grid, obviously. Since I got all those fear grids no. or those spheres from um from the Seymour fight. So, yeah. Phew! Damn, that was weird. <laughs> but, no. Alright. Taste my money, bitch! That's pretty much all we gotta do here. Alright, I'll taste that money anyway. Spare me! Yeah. Change, change. I don't have any change. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah. Don't you touch big tits. No one touches the tits. Know your place, bitch. <laughs> and again, oh, we got another weapon for Lulu. The late paint Uh <laughs> Wow, slow touch. Okay, that makes perfect sense. That makes perfect sense. Whew. Man. Let's um let's slow down the encounter rate. Wanna see if we can find Rika first. But yeah, watch out for those sandworms. They are very fucking annoying. Riku! Oh. Hey guys! Hey! Where's Uni? Gone. 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 Some guardian I am. Ooh. Damn. Um, there's something I want to tell you, but promise not to say anything. Hmm? No glaring either. <laughs> I know where we are. We're on Bicanel Island. Whoa. There's a place us all bed call home near here. Uni's there. I'm sure of it. Other Albed must have come and rescued her. Rescued? You mean kidnapped? What does it matter as long as she's safe? Yeah. That's right. Anyway, I will take you there if you promise that you won't tell anyone about it. Especially not Yevonites, okay? You know they don't like us Albed. Who knows what they'll do if they knew? Give me a break. What are you accusing Yevon of this time? Yevon did something really bad to us before. Well, you Albed must have deserved it. I beg your pardon? Waka! Uh, can't you guys talk about this later? Just promise you won't tell anyone about this island. Promise? Waka. Waka, come on! All right, I promise. Lead the way. You got it. Wow, man. Ha I mean, Waka, I already knew you were a racist, but bruh, bruh, that was a little much. Like seriously, you don't know what Riku or her, um, or her, um, her, her clan have been through. You know what I mean? You don't know anything about the outbed at all, and yet 
You're just basing your hatred on them just off of the fact that sin is here. That might not even be the case at all. We just don't know anything. That way. Oh my gosh. It's just... It, it's, it's unreal how racist one person can be. So much so to the point that they just lose all sense of logic. Like, at all. In any case, remember that Albat Primer 14 that I missed earlier? That way. Now, we can get it in this desert. Uh, let me handle the Makina. I can take them apart piece by piece. Yeah, I know you can. This is another tutorial battle with Riku. But, of course it shows up even when I have the no encounters thing one. So it's like, no, it's just that important. Move, bitch! There you go. Who knew? Who the fuck needs steel when you could just throw money at the enemy? I mean, come on. But yeah, it, that tutorial battle puts Lulu for some odd reason in the in the formation slot, even though she wasn't already there. That was uh, whatever. That being said, though, now we can start running into enemies again. We got Riku now. All right, but the encounter rate in the desert is so shit. Uh, which way was it again? Mm. Yeah, the encounter rate is really bad here in the desert. Bruh. Victory is ours! <laughs> Hell nah! Yeah, um, out of here! Bye! Live and let live! Yeah! Live and let live! Peace, homie! <laughs> Fuck that shit. But yeah, Riku will lead the way for us during our journey through Bikinel Desert. Which, or Sanubia Desert. Bikinel Island. What the fuck ever. Bruh! You're in the way! Bitch! There you go. Move! There you go. Told ya! You like that? <laughs> What's this? Home ahead. Hmm. In any case, now, you're probably wondering, Mike, you mentioned Albat Primer 14. Where exactly is it? Well, it's right here! I wasn't expecting it to be right here. This was just pure luck. All right! I wasn't expecting Albat Primer 14 to be there. How can a bird grow so big? I know, right? Why are you so huge? You're too big to be a bird. So, why don't you take a hint? Yaka! Yeah. Get on your knees and tell me you love me. <laughs> Move, bitch! There you go. Night, night, birdie. <laughs> But yeah, I was expecting Albed Primer 14 to be in a, um, another area here inside the desert. I wasn't expecting to get it so damn quickly. But that's actually good, because now I don't have to look for it. Woo! Right. You're in the way. That being said, though, we got some more enemies here. Sandwa. Let's see. 450 HP. The fire and ice. You can steal sleeping powders from them. Other guys here, Alcyons. Um, that's how I pronounce the name. 430 HP, we to fire! Um, let's see here. Alcyons, you can steal smoke bombs from them. If you have bribe for Riku, which probably at this point you probably won't. <laughs> um, you can, um... Ugh! You can get, um, some mega potions from them. But you gotta bribe it from them. You can do that. Good job. Yeah. Ah! Clip those yeah. wings. Yeah! <laughs> Clip those wings. Yeah. Wet that ass. That being said, though. All right, now we can move on. Now, Sanubia Desert is a really large area. You thought Makalania was annoying to navigate through as far as, like, you know, the random encounter rates? For example, granted, Makalani, uh, I'm talking Makalani Woods. Lake Makalani was really nothing. 
but yeah, my Sanubia Desert is immensely annoying to, to traverse through. For one thing, you got the encounter rate, which is incredibly stupid. Isn't there an easier way? No complaining. <laughs> Just follow through! There you go. Single file, bitches! <laughs> Move! Ah! Do not pass go. Do not collect 25 cents. You like that, don't you? Yeah, bet you do. Freaky birds. That being said, though, all right, let's turn the encounters code on again. <laughs> yeah, the encounter rate in the desert is just really awful. But yeah, you live and you learn. Now, the Sanubia Desert is actually one of my favorite areas in the game. You know I love ice and snow areas, so Makalani is definitely my favorite. But, the Sanubia Desert has a lot of unique enemies in it. Some of which, um, are only exclusive to this area. Like, for example, some of these Machina enemies. Though, not entirely. There is another area later in the game that does have some Machina enemies in it. But, like, the Mach Guards, for example, they, I think they're exclusive only to this area. I think. In any case, but yeah, the cactars for one, you can encounter cactars, of course, here too. I mean, this is a desert after all. Something is written here in our bed Beware of fiend, weaker fiend to the right, stronger fiend to the left. I, d I don't even have all the primers, and I can understand that. Shit. Could you understand that? Hmm. Well, I hope you could. I, I, wow, I use up all my save. <laughs> you only get 200 save points, um, 200 save slots in the PC version. I used up all 200. That was some from my previous playthrough, too. Wow. But in any case, over here, you get, I'll bet, primer volume. Uh, oh, that's volume 18. Perfect. I did get 17, right? Let me see. Let's see, 13, 14, got this today, 15, 16, where the fuck is 17? Wait a minute, okay, you can't get 17 here, where is it though, where is it? Ah, okay, I know where it is, it's, um, I think it's, oh, like way over here. There is a secondary area over here, so let's go check this out real quick, like. Now, in this area is where the encounter rate gets really shitty. Now, in this area, you're bound to be running into treasure chests, just like back on the Mihin High Road. Uh, uh the Mihin High Road. <laughs> no, I mean the, the, the Moonflow, North Bank. But yeah, you can find treasure chests in this area, so just keep that in mind. But the encounter rate with them is just really annoying but if you get through that get albert primer volume 17 nice all right that's perfect all right there is another area to this desert but we'll go and explore that next time on let's play final fantasy 10 can we find unit in this big ass expansive desert well we got a ways to go if you guys enjoy you know what to do hit that like button Subscribe to the channel for gimme bits from me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify of my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment, duh. Till next time, dudes and dudettes, Mike from Rage Break Gaming. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Smell you later.